Welcome to our tutorial. In this video, we will demonstrate the proper setup and operation of the pH101 pH meter, ensuring accurate and reliable measurements. The pH101 pH meter comes with the main unit, an electrode arm, a pH electrode, a temperature probe, a standard pH buffer, power adapter, and a user manual. First, take the electrode arm, insert the connecting rod into the circular hole on the base plate, then swivel the arm 90 degrees to secure it in place. If the electrode arm isn't stable, remove the plastic cover on the right side and use a screwdriver to adjust the screw until it holds the desired position. Connect the USB cable to the meter, then plug the DC 5 volt power adapter into the wall outlet. Place the temperature probe into the circular hole at the center of the electrode arm and insert the jack plug into the ATC socket. Ensure a snug fit. Next, take the pH electrode and insert the BNC connector into the socket label electrode. Rotate it clockwise until it locks in place. Remember, don't pull on the cable afterward. Before use, remove the protective cap from the pH electrode. If you see air bubbles inside the glass membrane, gently shake the electrode downward to dislodge them. To power on the meter, press the measure key for about 5 seconds. Use the mode option to switch between pH and ORP. If the temperature probe is not detected, the meter switches to manual mode. Press and hold the mode key, adjust the temperature with the up and down keys and press enter to save. To access the setup menu, press and hold the CAL key. From there, you can choose CAL to configure calibration points, BUFF to set the pH buffer group for calibration and auto recognition, UNIT to select the measurement unit, HOLD for automatic endpoint locking, OFF to enable power, saving mode that switches off the device after 30 minutes of inactivity, and CLR to delete all data logs. Factory Reset Once you've made your selections, press Enter to save them. Press the CAL key to start calibration with three standard buffer solutions. Rinse the electrode, immerse it in the first buffer, and press Enter. When CAL2 display, rinse the electrode, immerse it in the second buffer, pH 4.01 and press enter. For CAL3, rinse the electrode. Immerse the electrode in the third buffer, pH 10.01 and press enter again. The display will confirm calibration complete. Press the MR key twice, then press enter. After that, press the MR key again to check the slope of the electrode following the calibration. Rinse the electrode with distilled water and place it into the sample. If auto hold is enabled, the meter locks the measurement when stable. Press the MI key to store your readings. To view stored data, press the MR key. Thank you for watching. For more information and to explore our product range, please visit our YouTube channel.